can't disagree with uh, anything that Mr. Diaz said up here. I'll have to agree with you. Your chief of police has to be a leader. He has to have some leadership ability. I'm going to go a step further. Your chief of police is going to be a manager for your police department. He has to be a leader, and he has to have the experience required to run that police department the way it needs to be run. I have that experience. I've been involved with law enforcement right here in the city of Eunice for over 28 years. I'm very familiar with the issues important to the people of Eunice. I've been dealing with those issues for the last 28 plus years. I've served our police department as a patrol officer, a sergeant, a lieutenant, a shift supervisor, chief of detectives, chief juvenile officer, and I've supervised people for 23 of the last 28 years. So I have the supervision experience also, which is another requirement of our chief of police, somebody who can supervise. When it comes to leadership, I feel I've been a proven leader. I was one of the co-founders and organizers and the charter president of the Eunice Police Officers Association. 